Hi, and welcome to Family Unit. I'm Felicia, and today we're going to make a Mother's Day gift, a coupon book. Please subscribe, like, share, and comment. It really helps us out. Over in Cricut's Design Space, we're going to do a quick search and look for a coupon in the image library. We're going to scroll down until we find something we think will work for our project, and then click Add to Canvas. I'm going to go ahead and adjust the size of this image to something that's going to fit more for my project by adjusting the size in the ribbon across the top. And then under layers, I'm going to ungroup the two layers that are there and move the light pink one to the right and adjust the color to white. Now, this is actually going to be a print and cut, at least the white part is. So I'm going to add some text that says, One Dog Walk. And change the color to blue and move that up onto the white layer and adjust the size a little bit. And then I also want to go ahead and add an image. I know which one I'm looking for, so I'm going to go under the image library and do a quick search for a dog and then add that to canvas. Now I'm going to adjust the size with one of those corner boxes and I'm also going to rotate this image just slightly so that it fits nicely on my coupon. Once I have it adjusted just right, I'm going to go ahead and select all three layers and flatten them to make them a print and cut. Now I can no longer see the border of my ticket, so I'm going to go and change the background of my canvas by clicking on canvas on the right under layers and changing the color at the top to a light gray. Now I can see the edge of my coupon just right. And I'm going to go ahead and move that on top of the pink layer so I can get an idea, idea visually of what my image is going to look like. One image I selected has dashed lines, but I really want them to be a perforation so that mom can tear out the coupon she wants to use when she's ready to cash in. So I'm going to select the pink layer and select contour on the bottom right and click on each dash to hide them. Then I'm going to go under shapes on the left and select a line and I'm going to move it to where I want and adjust the height just the way I'd like it to be. And then under operation, I'm going to select the down arrow and change that to perforation. And then under the layers on the right, I'm going to select both the pink layer and the line and I'm going to attach them together. I've already created a few more coupons for my book and I have the layers hidden. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the eye next to each one of the layers and unhide them so that you can see what all my coupons look like. And I'm ready to make these. So the matte preview shows that the print and cut layers are actually on two pages, but I'm pretty sure I can get them all on one. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the second page and click on the triple dots next to one of the images and move it to the first matte. And then I'm going to go ahead and move that to the right and then rotate it so that it now fits on that page and I'm going to do the exact same thing for the second item on the second page. I'm going to get all of them on one mat, making my life a lot easier, saving us some paper and some time. The pink mat is, is fine and it's just going to be a cut. So I'm going to go ahead and continue and send the print and cut layer to the printer and make sure that I turn bleed off. And then once it's printed, I've added it to my mat and I'm running this through the Maker 3 to cut out my coupons. I'm going to do the same with the pink layer, but this time I'm going to remove the blade and I'm going to add in the perforation blade into the slot and go ahead and have the machine do the perforation part first and then when prompted, I will insert the blade. Assembly is easy. Just glue the white print and cut layer to the pink coupon. I did make one extra as a blank that someone could hand write in a coupon if they wanted.
When they are all done, tie them together with some ribbon and look, this is just a really cute, quick project to make. Could be for Mother's Day, could be Father's Day, could be for a birthday, whatever the occasion is. You can design these as simple as you want or as complex as you want. Enjoy.